Hi, I'm Jan Fabian Wally, and I have another watercolor painting tip of the day for you. Today we're going to use ordinary table salt to create a frosty look, a frost on a window, maybe a, a background texture for a floral, uh, a foreground texture uh, in a landscape. So many different ways to use this technique. A little bit goes a long way, so you want to be careful of how much you use it in any painting, but it's a great technique. Watercolor reacts with salt. Let me show you how, what I mean. So I'm going to put an even wash down on this sample paper. And when we have an even wash, we use a big brush loaded with paint and zi just zigzag down the paper. Now, especially for this technique, I want to get a good dark tone to the paint, to the even wash. So I'm going to just make sure I have a nice dark surface. Then I'm going to take some ordinary table salt, just put a little bit in my hand, and hold it up. Just drop those individual grains down on the wet paint, just as the paint is starting to soak into the paper. You can kind of watch that and, and see just as you, the fibers of the paper start to come up is the right time to put that salt down. Now that's going to take a few minutes to cook, as I call it. Let me show you what it looks like when it dries. Isn't that a great technique? Here's a painting that uh, I did using it just in the background. Adds a lot of uh, interest to the painting. Here's another. Have fun trying this technique and enjoy painting. If you want to see other tips and techniques with watercolor painting used in step-by-step how-to videos, go online to artistsnetwork.tv. In the search box, type in watercolor for beginners.